What's good? It's your boy Young Taz, and I'm back with another video. And today I'm going to be reviewing uh, Mac Mini M1 refurbished. Now I got this refurbished edition off the Apple website. Uh, it was like a hundred dollars off. Not a bad price. Highly recommend it. Now let's get this bad boy open. All right, let's get this bad boy out the box. All right, so in the box, we got the device itself. And I got the eight gigabyte version. I get some instruction manuals and most likely a sticker and a power cord. So let's do the sighting part, take this plastic off. And this bad boy is sexy. I'm not going to lie. And this is for simple people. If you already have a monitor, keyboard, and a mouse, then you really don't need anything else with this. On the back, we got a power port, Ethernet, two USB-C slash Thunderbolt, Thunderbolt ports, HDMI, two USB ports, and a 3.5 millimeter uh, headphone jack. And also a, a heat vent. Uh, and inside we got the instructions. Don't care about that. Some other work, paperwork, and a big ass Apple sticker. Bigger than usual. So, all right, we're gonna get you set up. All right, I got it plugged up and run into an issue. So I'm assuming that the new M1 Mac Minis aren't supported with every monitor i have an hp monitor pretty old but it's flickering black and white so i'm just gonna have to connect it to my tv give me a second all right so i got to connect to my tv and this is a 65 inch and it's crispy but this is gonna be annoying so i guess i'm gonna have to invest into a monitor and for a little disclaimer, before you purchase this Mac Mini, make sure your devices are compatible. This is not gonna work with every keyboard, every mouse is not gonna work with every monitor. Please don't do what I did before you purchase it. Make sure your devices that you already have is compatible or you're gonna have to purchase some new devices to go with your Mac Mini. You can't really see it in this video, but these pixels are like super crispy. And I'm coming from a 2011 MacBook Pro. So I guess I have a whole 10 years that I missed out as far as like retina and quality with uh, Mac minis. So I guess this will conclude my unboxing for now i'm gonna come back in a month to tell you everything i like about the mac mini m1 and everything i hate um so far i'm not liking this hdmi thing it might be a 4k issue my monitor isn't 4k i think it's only 720p so pretty dated but it has an hdmi port in it so i'm not sure why it doesn't work maybe the mac mini only supports certain 4k displays i'm not sure i gotta do some more reach search in it but uh other than that if you uh like the video please like subscribe and uh look forward to some future videos and uh thanks for watching peace